welcome back guys uh next episode so i think we're on five not sure but uh we do need to save because i forgot to yet again going to save i try to do those like once every episode and then possibly a couple more extra times just in case the game has yet to crash on me but you never really know so Kinda have to keep an eye on it. Uh, let's go ahead and put him back to sleep. I believe it was 1160 to purchase a settler. Yes. So we're getting closer. At 991 right now. 999 actually. Oh, I did not notice that. There is only one. Hit research. We need. Okay, good. We're in a whole new era. Monastery, Garden, Angle Watt, Mega Sophia, which is extremely amazing for a bunch of different reasons. <laughs> um, Gen Itza, Mint, Market, National Treasury, Machu Picchu. Hmm. Engineering is amazing for Aqueduct. That is so great to have. Aqueduct as well as a uh, hospital or not hospital. The one later in the game that gives you the same thing basically it stacks with it. Uh, I think we're going to go with theology for now. So go ahead and grab that. Hopefully kill that unit. Yeah. Try to move him back down there next turn. Alright, so we're up to 1014 cash. Bring our shit back down here to heal it. Ah, there we go, new policy. Alright, for finishing this policy, grant a free great person of your choice near the capital. Let's grab mediocrity, which will give us happiness, which we need for our new city that we're going to build soon. Now, this is the hanging gardens. So, what we're going to do is take a great engineer and bring him over here. Which means this unit needs to be moved out of here so that we can move him in. Okay, so. Bring this back up here. And try to get him over here pretty quickly. I don't believe I ever finished the mine right here either. Oh, really? Hmm. Okay, anyway, bring him in here. And we're going to hurry production of that. Okay, good. He's finished that, so we need to come back down here. I believe this tile was never finished for some reason. I guess a unit was too close or something. I think there we go. Immortal heard the word. We got plus 10 food, which is great in the city. Now we should begin work. Free social policy. 25% great people generation in this city and one culture we'll get more culture with this and we'll also get a free policy which a free policy is awesome so I believe we're going to work we really need more science it's kind of a fight because a library is not going to help as much in this city because it doesn't have as much growth as much citizen growth. So I believe we're going to have to go with an oracle for now. We just don't have the citizen growth to be able to get a library yet. Finish our mine. We're up to 1066 gold. So a few more turns. Alright, our walls are finished, so we should get... Hmm... Most likely a barracks. We are going to need units pretty soon. Luckily, 
luckily. Knock on wood. We haven't been attacked yet. Other than bar barbarians, of course, but you can't really prevent that. Okay, so we just expanded to six here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Go ahead and lock that one in. 17 turns to an expansion. Hmm. Let's see, if we drop one food for two production, we're going to have 41 turns to build this and 20 turns for growth. So we'll gain, we'll gain three turns on a new citizen, but we'll shorten our building by seven turns. So personally, I think that's a better choice. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Sorry, I can't do a research agreement with you, man. Okay, so he has iron and he has gold. Neither of which I really need at the moment. Hmm. And he's broke. He doesn't have... He only has three gold per turn income. So we'll be done with that conversation with him. <laughs> Okay, we're at 1131, I believe it was 1160 to purchase. Yeah. So a few more turns. Someone else has entered the medieval era. Wow, our score is in second place somehow. Alright, so next turn we will have the gold we need. Beautiful. So we'll go ahead and send him up here because we're going to need two working so that we can have stuff produced quicker. Oh, I forgot I have a worker in the city, so we need to move him out. And go ahead and purchase Settler. Okay, now the Settler needs to get his little ass moving. Hopefully I can get him up there safely without any issues. I hope. <laughs> Which I could actually... No, I think I really want to get that iron and gold. So I believe I'm going to have to build up here. So let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. Three, so right up here, I believe is going to be the best choice for me. Possibly here. That would give me a guaranteed. No, I think I'm going to go with the mountainous area to get more production earlier. I don't know. I'll weigh the situation once we get up here. I guess. Just make him go to sleep for now. Okay, so we can run a, a road through here to connect it, which will connect to our capital, which will be a lot shorter than running a road down here. Now, if we put it in this tile, get our next turn here. If we put it in this one here, we're going to get one, two, and three which would include the sheep and it would also go one two three which would include deer but we're still gonna miss out on those gems until we get an, an expansion up here and we'll go one two three this way so we would get this wheat tile in there which would be very nice one two three so we would get up to here we wouldn't really get any water tiles which is fine with me get a stone but if I go here we're not going to get the wheat I think I'm gonna have to go with this spot just so that we can get this water tile and this wheat because that wheat is going to be a very big deal so we'll go ahead and produce that there okay so we finished barracks down here so let's start with Either a temple or a coliseum. 
I think it's just went down to three, so let's do our work on the Colosseum. Production up here, we want to always start with a monument. Let's see what we have selected here. We have two food initially, so we're going to be stagnant for the first uh, for the first 29 turns. Let's see, 29 versus 39. I'd rather shave 10 off and be stagnant for one turn. Okay, so uh, you go ahead and start work on a mine, and you start work. Um. Let's see, start working on a farm in there. Go ahead and attack that unit. I don't like it being there. It most likely won't scare it away, it will just move down or attack. Okay. So fortify that unit. It means I'm gonna have to move this unit out a little bit to get a little more view of the area. Uh, London can fire upon an enemy. Okay. Fire upon that enemy then. Okay, move him up one more tile. Oh, well, hello there. <laughs> uh, we get extra food from that, which we're going to need early. We can always change it later. Or no, we wouldn't be able to change it, but we can always use these two for lumber mills. So that's fine. Uh, minor defeat is fine with me. I have three turns to a growth there, four here. On our next growth... Our next growth is probably going to be here. I believe that would be about the best production choice I can have. Alright, so next turn. I hope he doesn't attack. <laughs> of course. Okay, uh, definitely heal that unit up. And attack that. Let me move him down here. Get rid of this the easy way. Okay, so they have eight more turns, and they have four more turns. Yeah, I figured he would back up once I moved down here. Get rid of that unit. Just being a nuisance down there. Alright, next turn. I think I want to at least attack this unit and start getting some experience on my ship here. Okay, is this... nope, still at a stalemate, so we'll wait. And we do not have iron yet, which I really need to get to. Let me see if I can buy that tile. 38 turns for a growth. Whoops, no, not that one. Bio tile. 195 to purchase that tile. Which I will definitely do as soon as I get 195. That is going to help us a lot. Go ahead and keep attacking there, buddy. Try to kill that unit off. And then I can move something down there. Probably just take a worker and run him down there to capture it. Alright, so this expanded. Let's see. It did choose the one that I wanted to choose. Okay, so. Our next growth is here or here, which is in three turns. Ah, this expanded to, three, to seven uh, citizens. Okay, so 21 turns. 18 turns. Let's change to that and we'll have 17 turns 23 turns was that 21 before yeah so what if we got rid of both that would be 26 turns and 16 turns so I'm gonna go ahead and go with the production for now try to get the Oracle built for anybody else but now that I said that I'm sure we won't get it <laughs> okay decisive victory Hopefully get this unit over here to help. Because I believe we may need it. Okay, we have enough money to buy our tire now. So go ahead and buy that. That opened 
Or no, that hasn't opened iron yet, has it? I need to... And that unit's gone. I need to build a mine on it for it to uh, open that. Okay, so now we're down one more unit at this point. Which is not good. They're most likely going to start pushing towards Nottingham. Because I do have workers up there. Okay, so that should kill that unit. Yep. Trying to get close enough with that unit, but not close enough to get it attacked. Right, go ahead and spot this area here. Okay, need to get him working on a mine there. Whoops, okay, get him in the water. Not the the best choice of unit to go use down here, but that's what I wanted to use. Go ahead and skip his turn. Definitely need to work on that. Alright, so have production here done. So we need to work on a granary. And we are gonna change that over to this. Or to this, sorry. Because we're about to have an extra food there. Start getting us some growth there instead of just production. Alright, theology is done. We are in finally in the medieval era. Okay, so next we need to get... Thinking currency may be the best choice. But civil service is also very nice. It gives a lot of bonuses. Let's go with civil service for now. That will help us grow our cities here. Okay. Alright, I'll be back in just one second, guys. And we're back. Uh, I've been recently like about halfway through uh, the video or the filming uh, stop filming and restart the filming and it it seems to help with lag a little bit so I'm probably gonna stick with doing that so every now and then it'll cut out for just a second and I'll just put like a little fade or something in there just so you guys know that that's why I've been cutting it out so much Okay, let's go ahead and we have 42 turns here, 8 turns for our, uh, our oracle, let's see where our growth is, 1 turn growth, which will be here, we can go ahead and get our unit down there, uh, London will grow in 63 turns, which means it just grew right here, okay, so next turn we'll move a unit up there. Good. This grew, so we will put a farm here, and we will fortify that. Let's move this unit up here. Okay, a mine would be two production, and we would lose a food, so we'd have three production there. A farm would add farm would add one production? Hmm. I think our best choice would be lumber mill. Can I keep it balanced there? And this is about to finish its construction. Okay, so we definitely need Hagia Sophia. That is something I always build no matter what. And just hope to hell that I actually get it. <laughs> okay, so we have our farm built here. So now that it, that expedited our growth. Uh, next, we want to get... Let's go ahead and start here. Uh, the Oracle has been built. 
really? I just can't build a wonder in this game, apparently. It's just... <laughs> they don't want me to build any in this one. Okay, let's see. I have three happiness. Let's see. I believe a library might finally be needed. Let's go ahead and start work on the library. Um, actually a research agreement would be possible No, so we'll go ahead and do that. Alright, so this one has fresh water, this one does as well. All of these do because of the, the water here, the lake. I um, believe, yeah, rivers are fresh water also, so these all have fresh water. Um, these do not have fresh water, but this one and this one does. So once I finish civil service, all of these will be producing extra food, which is amazing. All these farm ones, of course. Which is all that's over here. <laughs> and then this one will most likely be a farm in the end. Uh, we have 10 turns to growth. 32 to growth. 15. And our next building to come up would be the library right here. So we'll kind of stay near this city here. Okay, uh, let's see. Let's get another farm built up here pretty quick. Now we have two iron, which is great. Uh, open borders has ended. Okay, let's get... Let's get a lumber mill here. Although we have a lot of production. Okay, that's fine. Except... Actually, since we did just accept that, let's see. Let's discuss... Joint declaration? Okay, that's fine. I wasn't really banking on it, I was just wondering. <laughs> Whoa. What is he doing all the way? <laughs> that's interesting. Anyway, uh, let's see. So that's done. We can't do anything else with him. So let's go ahead and bring him this direction. And we will start work on a road shortly to open a trade route. Alright, so we have 323 gold. Let's see if we can buy another tile here that would help us no I guess let's start work on road and bring him over here as well I guess all right 24 turns two turns seven turns which this one is awesome because it will be eight citizens and have the library finished whoa Someone is actually beating me in production. That's not even right. That's it's not allowed. It's supposed to be the most productive. Always, no matter what. Okay. Let's start work on... I, really... I cannot make something that, that costs... Cost maintenance right now. Let's go ahead and start work on Anchor Watts. Although I'm sure somebody else will finish it before me. Just like somebody will finish the Hagia Sophia before me. Okay, so let's go over here and get a farm built up. I forgot to check this. It went for this one, which is two food, one production. Hmm. If we get rid of that, that'll be 40 turns. 
make that 37 turns for the production. So wait, let's see, 47 turns production on Hagia Sophia. Let's see if we can fix that a little bit. Let's go ahead and stunt growth. Cannot drop this one. We can drop this one, which is really going to hurt us, but we need to. Okay. Now let's also drop... I really don't want to drop another three food. That would make us stagnant. Um... If we do, it would be this one because that one has production tile on it. Okay, so let's see. 39 turns versus 35 turns. And we won't be stagnant. It'll be 109 turns. So I think that's about the best we can do to speed production. Let's check over here. Change production. It would take 40 turns, so no. Okay, that's about the the most production we can push out of each one right now. Um, there is an encampment right here that we should probably get rid of. Okay, so let's go ahead and save before I forget. And that will end the episode, and uh, we'll come back next time, hopefully things will go our way. <laughs> Hoped every turn or every time but it hasn't happened yet so we'll see. Uh, thanks for watching guys and definitely come back for the next episode.